Recently, about 10.30 at night, I got a phone call from an automobile dealer. Doesn't matter what type of automobile franchise, let's just say one of the American ones. $780,000 out of trust. I advised him that Ford would be in there at any minute to make sure that their collateral was represented and watched. All of the lenders, all of the automobile companies, from Ford Motor Credit, Chrysler Credit, Bank of America, they have a universal operating book. They follow it perfectly. They don't deviate. No matter how much they tell you that they're friends with you, once you're out of trust with them, it's strictly a money issue. Another old saying that my father told me once was, don't worry, son, it's not about the money. It's about the money. The bank's only looking after their interests. They don't care about your home, your family, your children, your grandmother, your grandma. Whoever's home they've got to seize and get a temporary restraining order from the sheriff's department to secure their collateral, they're going to take those actions, and it's well within their legal rights. These are things that should make you nervous, but they shouldn't be fearful. We can handle them. We can't hide from them. That 10.30 call I got at night was from my friend who said, don't worry, I really get along with this company and they're going to work with me. About a week later, I got a call that he had been served with a restraining order and was no longer allowed on the premises. The partner that he was now having a problem with was also filing criminal charges against him for a couple of the telephone calls he had made in a threatening manner. These things can spiral out of control overnight. They don't have to. We let those things happen because we either have a false sense of security or we get into a state of denial. It doesn't matter if you're an attorney, a doctor, a dentist, an insurance representative, a banker, no matter what your level of education, these things can knock on your doorstep. And they can be the big bad wolf. You know, whatever's caused them has culminated in this nervous time that we need to get together, put our heads together, and make a game plan. Even in accounting, which I hate counting numbers, but the accountants always say you have to have a short-term and a long-term goal. Let's make a plan. Let's get out of this now. Once again, we want to be at your service immediately. There will be no runaround. If you call us now, we'll have our people or myself involved in your situation immediately. Thanks for the phone call.